Well, hey there, YouTube. This is Mark in Northeast Indiana at my local fish and wildlife area. And today I'm going to have a little bit of a different video for you. Um, came over here to do some, just run a few rounds through some firearms. So you're going to see some of that when I get back to the shop. And you'll see at the end of this video, I'm going to show you a clip of my latest uh, acquisition. I went over to the gun shop today. Today is Saturday, um, the 13th of April and picked up my latest acquisition. And so I'll show that to you. You'll actually see it in the clips, um, depending on how I arrange the video. I don't, I'm not even sure, but what a beautiful day in uh, Northeast Indiana. Look at this, 60 degrees sunny just a little bit of wind and just a lot of activity out here at the fish and wildlife uh, area um, the state ground has they have a target range um, and I went there this is a probably about an hour from my house um, because uh, I don't have a range at my place that I can use and so I went there because I was shooting uh, a carbine and my gun shop uh, just allows handguns. So I can shoot my handguns at the gun shop, but uh, I gotta go elsewhere for uh, my long gun. So today I ran some rounds through um, my carbine. Boy, it's hard for me not to tell you what I got. Um, and then, I, you know, that uh, Steven 16 gauge double barrel uh, I ran just a few rounds through that just to see if that shoots safely because I, you know, I picked that up at a pawn shop and I got a great deal on that. And that thing shoots great. Um, boy, I can't wait to use that hunting. And then I uh, ran some rounds through my Ruger Super Wrangler, and those were both 22s and 22 mag, and shoots just like a dream. And so, uh, man, I was just, this was just what I needed today. I wasn't going to come out here. Um, I got so much to do at the house, uh, but my wife was, my wife went with me to the gun shop. She signed up for a, uh, a ladies class, uh, basic pistol class. And I had to pick up my new acquisition and she was, we were coming back. I was like, man, I should just go run some rounds through that. And she's like, why don't you do that? And I'm like, it's so far away. It's an hour drive away. I'm glad I did. Just, just a beautiful day. Um, I really don't like shooting at public ranges. Uh, I'm, I'm very paranoid about gun safety, uh, as everyone should be. Maybe not paranoid, but very mindful of it. And uh, there was a group of about five guys next to me and uh, I don't know if it'll come through on any of the video clips I have but boy they're hooping it up and everything and the, the range safety officer actually had to get after them one time because one of their partners there was going down range to put uh, paper up and they they had all their guns in their hands pointed down range and I you know the way the I think I have a picture of the range that I'll put in here but the way it's set up you know I can't see next the, the, the stall next to me, um, but evidently they were unsafe, which made me paranoid, really paranoid when I walked down. Uh, I made sure everyone knew when I was heading down on the 50 yard range here, I'm like, hey, I'm going down. And one guy in that group uh, seemed to be an experienced firearm owner and he was like, okay, let's put our guns down. And so I felt a little bit better, but uh, great time, got to do some shooting. Um, spent about an hour out here. This weather's beautiful. I'm gonna go back to the house and do some yard work and things like that. Uh, a little bit different video. I wasn't even planning this video. So enjoy the clips and then I'll show you what I got when I get back to the shop. <music>
All right, we're back in the shop, and by now you probably have guessed my new acquisition uh, from the gun shop. It is this, it's a High Point Model 995. It is clear and safe. Um, it's nine millimeter, and it's carbine, obviously. Uh, everybody has an opinion about High Point, and some people hate them, some people like them. This is the first High Point I've ever owned. And I ran a box of Target uh, ammunition through it today, 50 rounds. Had absolutely no issue with it. Um, you can see that it fires just fine in the clips. Uh, this is really enjoyable to shoot, actually. Um, I like it a lot. Um, gonna get rid of this sticker, I don't like that. But, uh, you know, I just pulled it out of the box. I literally just bought it this morning or picked it up. So, like, uh, I like it. Could be putting a, a red dot on here, probably. I may put a uh, four grip on there, maybe something with a light. Not sure. Um, for right now, my intention with this is to. Um, just get more and more familiar with it by running rounds through it. Um, I'll be uh, just like I say, just using it for target practice initially. Um, may eventually move to a home defense uh, weapon with it, uh, but right now um, I don't feel like I'm comfortable enough with it to do that. And I've got other means of uh, defending my family right now, so. Uh, but this is it. I like it a lot. It's uh, I mean, what can I say? I mean, it's for the price. Um, it's a good way to get into a carbine, and um, I enjoyed it. Boy, I just had a blast out at the range today. Uh, just beautiful weather, and. Just, I mean, I just forgot how fun shooting was. I haven't been shooting in a long, long time. And uh, I really wish that now I would have kept up with it. But uh, it was fun. Everything was fun. Uh, everything performed really well. Um, I shot the 16 gauge, the Super Wrangler. And I, I'm not sure if I mentioned it earlier, but I did shoot that Stevens um, 20 gauge I picked up earlier single shot and uh, that was I just ran a couple rounds through that just to kind of see how it did that thing that thing will be a turkey killer rabbit killer any kind of birds that I'm hunting um, really happy with everything today so with that I'm gonna wrap it up hope you enjoyed this video it's a little bit different uh, than a lot of my videos but just had to show the new acquisition and show you something away from the shop Hope you get out to your favorite spot this weekend. I hope it's beautiful wherever you're at. I hope you find peace and uh, hope you come along for the next one. Thank you to the new subscribers and we hope to see you on the next video. Cheers.